Good morning. We are waking up soggy, especially along into the south of the state line. We've got passing showers pushing in from the Gulf, and you can expect that through the morning hours. You can see how they're moving from the west to the east, affecting mainly northeastern Florida. It looks like the corner of southeastern Georgia there, Camden and Glynn County, also getting wet. And these showers, although they're pushing west to east, are gradually pushing south. Didn't stop our chilly temperatures though. Upper 40s for Valdosta and Waycross, mid 40s for Lake City this morning, and upper 40s for Jacksonville. Here's a look at what you can expect for today. Definite rain this morning, especially along to the south of the state line. Mostly cloudy skies. After lunch, we'll see gradually, we'll start to gradually dry out as these showers push further to the south. That does mean Gainesville over to St. Augustine will stay soggy for most of the day today. We'll top out at 57 degrees. Here's a look at your hour by hour forecast showing a soggy morning along into the south of the state line. Southeastern Georgia is just seeing some breezy cloudy conditions. During the afternoon hours, we do start to dry out along I-10, but from Gainesville to St. Augustine could see persistent rain. Overnight tonight, we'll aggressively clear out as we see much colder air headed our way, putting us in the 30s for Monday morning. We're topping out in those upper 50s after a wet morning. It's chilly and breezy for today with mostly cloudy skies. We'll see 60% chances for rain. After your lunch hour, they start to decline down to about a 30% chance for rain around sunset. We'll see no chances for rain to kick the work week off in those upper 30s on Monday morning, making for a chilly start to your work week. The chilliest day though is on Tuesday where we get down into the mid 30s to kick things off and only warm up to 52 degrees, meaning most of Tuesday spent in those 40s. We do start to see warmer temperatures head back our way by the weekend though, with decent chances for showers, we'll be hitting those low 70s for afternoon highs. I'm meteorologist Rebecca with your instant weather update.